Yeah, this area seems super laggy compared to, like, last patch. Um, it, how am I not, it depends on how the Valk hits. If you uh, hit at the right angle, the Valk basically either takes no damage or very, very little damage. In fact, if you hit the Valk on the wing, like that, it does nothing. So you can actually use that to turn really quickly. You might want to consider putting up the Valk HP bar back up on the stream so people can actually see whether or not it does damage. <laughs> yeah. Because looking at it now, I see you crashing into stuff and not anything happening. Because there really isn't any damage. Yeah, they're just saying, even if there was, somebody watching would know. Xcal says, we peasant keyboard players explode at the first pixel against an obstacle. I've done the same. I've done the same kind of stuff with a mouse, and it does, it, the control method doesn't make a difference. It all has to do with the Valk. The Valk is very, very uh, resilient at tumbling around the ground. But not against archers. No. Oh yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, that's the other thing. If there's a, there's a bunch of weird Valk glitches where if somebody in the rumble seat pulls out a weapon, the Valk can instantaneously explode for no reason. It Literally. hasn't been happening nearly as often as it used to, though, because I've been trying. <laughs> it's pretty much instantaneous death. Now it's just the repair grenades you can barely use. Repair grenades... It's usually the archer. The archer usually just, like, you're dead. No warning. Go, go, orbital strike! Please. Oh, that was a lot of certs right there. Um, the lib can... The, the lib can definitely work with this setup. I, the ESF, for a number of reasons, doesn't really work that well. The less you have to aim, the better that this setup works. And it's basically due to how planet side wants you to try to aim, which is with a mouse. This is not very good at, like, any kind of reaction speed because in order to get maximum input like if I want to go maximum if I want to go from one end of pitch to the other end of pitch then I have to transition through the entire joystick axis in order to get maximum to maximum uh, output and kind of the same thing for um, the small area I don't know if you can even see me moving the joystick but anything kind of in the small area doesn't work very well um, and your quality of joystick is going to make the biggest difference there because it has all to do with how how smooth the gimbal setup works in your joystick. If you don't have a smooth gimbal and you don't have good sensors, it just will not work to aim at all. But I have tried uh, I have tried with the Lib to some success, but I have a lot more experience with a Valk. Ah, shit. Oops. No, we're good. Oh, what? This will be good as new. I'm just deployed in the middle of nowhere. Welcome to glitches. At least it didn't Whoa. kick you through the map. Nice or to have it. you flying around today. <laughs> a shame if something were to help you through the ground. Wouldn't he the Abyss of endless void of space. Blue Sea Gaming says, uh, How difficult was it to set up your HOTAS properly? I have a SciTech X52 Pro and have struggled to set it up properly. Um, well, if I remember correctly, if the if they have X52 Pro works like the old X52, then it just treated as one input device. 
in which case it should be pretty easy to set that up by comparison um planet side is really 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 picky about inputs um it'll only work with one input device so if your if your computer has attacks more than one input device it could possibly work but it'll only be the first one and you don't have any control of the order so it makes it very difficult i'm planning on having a video go up this weekend my youtube is below the stream and i'm actually going to talk about using a joystick in planet side and how to set one up so hopefully um that video is going to solve a lot of people's problems but with the next 52 as long as it's the only thing that's connected like, like nine o'clock yep see him as long as it's the only thing that's connected, like no gamepad, no Xbox controller, no PlayStation controller, whatever the hell you want to use, as long as nothing else is connected, you can probably get Planet Side to detect it. Um, apart from that, like bindings and stuff like that, um, yeah, the more analog access inputs you can get, the better off it's going to be. Go for the sights right in front of us. Enjoy your fucking strikers. Whatever has the smoothest gimbal, like whatever stick is the least amount of stickiness to it, will, will work the best. Here. There are some, there's some what people consider high quality sticks out there that will have really shit gimbals for um, planet side. So the sticks aren't very sticky? They're very sticky. Or they have really heavy springs. I mean, this stick that I'm using right now actually has the, the heavy set of springs in it, but it's nothing compared to some of the other sticks that are out there. coming in. The lead. I lost so many mozzies. Uh ants did it. Yep. Oh there's a there's a there's a uh vanguard on the ground there too, we've gotta to be careful. Careful will be my middle name. I think he needs to be careful. The kid is asking about uh, first person and third person view and using it in different vehicles. Um, for the Valk, you definitely want to be third person that's just because you don't really need to be first person there's you're not aiming so it's just better situational awareness yeah it does it does mess with your brain a little bit because like when i'm like this if i want to go to the left then i have to be pitching up which is not what you normally think of so it does mess with your brain with a little bit if you're used to first person uh esfs you definitely want to be first because you need to aim libs you go first, third, doesn't matter. Depends on whether you're using the main... You, depends on whether you're using the chin gun or not. 
galaxy again. You might as well go third. Planet size not a simulator, so. Oh, oh, oh my god. Galaxy high above us. Got the guy on that hill just hosing, hosing the area with this chain gun from 100 meters away. That was, that nice. was great. <laughs> just, just dinged him in the head. Absolutely duper shit-ass lucky for me. Oh, we got an ant. Got him. Goodbye. Oh no! No! Well, that's one way. Fuck! Boop. 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 Yeah. Bluesy Gaming says X52. It is. Thanks for the help. I'm I'm gonna try to get that video. Video if you're having trouble. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get that. I'm really trying to get this video. I've done it like I've been working on it for a while. We might be going for a base. I've been working on it for a while, and I keep going back and forth on what I should include and what I shouldn't include. Oh, okay. Good job, Shirax. Your base killed him for us. Nice. I checked to see if you didn't bail out. <laughs> I've been uh, I've been trying to. Sunder. Yeah. Oh, get the mag, get the mag, get the mag. Wee. Yeah, you can actually hit the ground pretty hard in a, in a Valk. Oh, it discussed the old Rumble Seed glitch. Oh yeah, there was, yeah, there was, yeah, I'll get to that in a second. Um, yeah, so, yeah, hopefully, hopefully that video comes out soon. I've been working on it, and I keep rewriting it, and blah, 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 blah. I'm really going to try to have it out this weekend. Alright, so underneath the bridge on the, the frame, there's a heavy just throwing rockets. He's spotted. Oh, right, I see him, yeah. Um, Zakata says, right on, first time here, I dig your setup. Thank you. Is he under the bridge? Under the bridge, yeah, in the frame. In oh, the frame, uh, under the bridge. Oh, I see, he's under, yeah, okay. He's under, like, the trusses. Thank you. Bye! Splat! <laughs> if you, if you want to know more about my setup, uh, I do have some videos on YouTube. And, uh... But yeah, the Planet Side one is... If you're interested in Planet Side and you're interested in the setup, then hopefully the video this weekend is going to be going to be really good. Right, I'm going to try flying again. Subscribe, follow, like, blah, 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 all those fun things. You forgot thumbs up. Bell, you can the thing. <laughs> yeah. Hey, two uh, galaxies. Motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're repairing themselves faster than we can damage them. Unless we, unless we sit right on them. I'll get my thumbs right over one of them, I'll drop them C4 on them. Guys, back on the bridge. I'll get my uh, Tomcats out for those uh, galaxies. Roger, roger. Oh, I see a lip. No, it's our lip. Never mind. We need ammo. The patch would give you some. It'd be a shame if we had a, had a player base. I know, right? I think the guy's player. back on the bridge trying to shoot things. Uh, when we land, Levy, will you dump down some ammo for me, please? Sure. My sunny right here. Doesn't get you points. Oh, okay. I guess that's true. The kid that says, I'll check it out. I'm looking to get an oh, entry set okay. of joysticks just to feel it out. I'm thinking most of your stuff is pretty high end. Um, yeah, there's a, this, the stick on my left is a modified verbal constellation way. delta. Yeah, me too. And the stick on my right is a, con mod is a uh, constellation alpha from verbal as well. What, uh, what sticks did you get? Sorry. 
I'm spawning a skill above you. Ready? The box right above you guys. <laughs> I was waiting for ammo. Ah. I'm just putting down a turret just in case something sneaks by. They always do. You can't deploy it. Oh, yes, you can! The uh, ASP turret, yep. Or not, not the ASP. It's a fire. I thought he was trying to. I thought Starbuck was trying to deploy it in the ground at first, or in the in the wireframe of, or the, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah. All right, those galaxies are coming back. Crazy. Have, nice, um, they have a VS uh, aircraft. After oh yeah, there's two libs after them. We can uh, totally yoink those. Yeah, there's way more VS than NC though, so. You're right, but we have a player base nearby, so we can retreat somewhere. Steal the cattle! Kill secure. I don't recommend go, go, keep going that direction. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. If we had another uh -uh. couple Tomcat mozzies to assassinate those libs, we could probably win. Probably. I mean, it was just a numbers game with that one. It's just a matter of pulling them off. I think those guys... A few of those guys are DA, so they're probably all communicating one squad, with one another. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so that's a no to the Cisco strategy, Vince. That's a no to the. That's a. It probably ain't gonna work on the Cisco. Why? Why does everything in this area have to shoot my Mozzie with yeah! infantry stuff? Oh, did you see that kill? Oh, that was awesome! Crunch. Black. Extra crunchy. Like a June bug. I would, for that price point, I would say you can't go wrong with uh, Thrustmaster T16000s. Those have Hall Effect sensors in them, which are really, really good. Um, the only real downside to the 16000 is they don't have a lot of buttons on the sticks themselves. Um, oh, something invisible on the top of that hill. There's a harasser right below us. Whee! Um, actually, the new variant of the T-16000, which is the Airbus variant, has two well, they're not both triggers, but there's a button right above the trigger, which I think is probably the best configuration for that stick. Um, but if you're looking for two two sticks, like to dual stick it, especially if you want to do like space sims, can't go wrong with dual 16,000s or any of the variants of the 16,000. You got Reaver coming in. Yep. Sixteen thousand. You got you got twist on both on on the stick. Their left or right hand grips, depending on how you configure them. And uh, yeah, and if you're looking for a throttle, there's the TCS version of the sixteen thousand, which has a throttle with it as well. So really, I can't recommend anything else because almost everything else in that price point doesn't have Hall effect sensors. You're, you're quite welcome. Yeah, I'm back. I'm back. Welcome, welcome back. Is my air conditioner running or is it good? Can't hear it at all. Wait. <laughs> but I like it. That mic's really good though. Yeah, the 16,000 is something we've talked about, like, at length. Um, simply because nothing in its nothing in its price range gets you that kind of gets you that kind of